Fuck you, Ronald. Alright, five, oh, game four, game. three, two, one. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Select to the End, Season 19. Hey. We have a new organizer called Burbo. Hello. Welcome. Alright, back to That's you me. now. <laughs> what, me? Yes. Oh, um, wait, wait no, Fernan? Where, where's Fernan? Is it my turn? I'm right here behind you. Ah! Fucking Where? up here. Where are you at? Okay, at hey, Fernan, yeah. Fernan, what are, we, what are we doing this season? We're doing a uh, almost vanilla game with delayed uh, tiered pick teams of four. Holy shit. Was that what it? does that mean? Yes. What does that mean? I mean no, that... no, Berber, what does that mean? Fuck. Yeah, what does that mean? Okay, that means that in uh, that when we scatter, everybody will be free for all. Uh, Fifty minutes into episode one, there's a tier uh, tier three people get to pick a tier four person to join on a team, and that continues until everybody's on a team. We have four tiers um, built with seven people each. Uh, that's about it, actually. Uh, yeah. We have teams, and they. Ah, uh, it's probably cold, cold bacon, bacon. joint. Yeah, but uh, shut up, Cold Bacon. We're doing the intro. If it is yeah, Cold Bacon. Yeah, what the hell, Cold Bacon? All right. So here are the twenty-eight players that we have this season, starting from tier four. We have the organizer Burbo. She's Hi. played all seasons from one to six, and all seasons from twelve to now, but none in between. After oh that, God. we have the previous organizer Frostbread. He has two kills in his seventeen seasons, and one of them was a team kill. Fuck you, Frost. Uh, after that, we have Longa Vida. He has two wins and two second places in his six seasons. Wacko Flipper, his last recorded round was in 2015, and he's also a newcomer. Stalas, before playing season 16, his latest season before that was 7. Katie, her first three deaths into the end were from things all starting with the letter S. Uh, and Frankie. I don't have anything for Frankie. Dude, Sorry, Frankie. Because I'm not a tier 4 player. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Frankie, he was the first person team killed into the end back in season 5, killed by Timon Shote. In uh -huh. tier 3, we have Timon Shote. He got the first ever team kill into the end in season 5 <laughs> on Frankie. <laughs> <laughs> we also have Lou Gregory, who hasn't gotten a, who hasn't gotten a kill since season 9. Fuck so you. That's sad. Uh, we have DVN or Dylan who was technically sort of supposed to play one of the first seasons, but he didn't have a good computer, and he's also a newcomer. Uh, we have me, and the fact for me is that I've died three times to falling in UHC, and all three have been into the end. We also have Chloe. She has a KD of one in to the end. And we have Don. He's a newcomer. Sorry, Don. Uh, <laughs> in tier two, we have BS Brent. Who I once called B Brent. We have <laughs> B Rory. <laughs> she is the first and only biological girl into the end. Oi! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try and argue your biological for a fucking second. <laughs> yeah, we have, <laughs> we have <laughs> Americ, aka Bill, who will allegedly be making the intro for this season. Pressure's on, buddy. <laughs> Unless everything falls for the last minute. Unless that. We have Jamie, who is one of the few people in their entire UHC recovery round community who has died to a zombie pigman. Into the end. <laughs> Specifically. Uh, we have the Sonic Joey, who won his first ever FFA, non recorded round and recorded round, in To the End Season 1. We have Kinako, who won his first uh, season of To the End he played in Season 12, which was big teams, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> uh, did I miss it? Oh, we have Kevin Peary, he's a returner from Season 11. Uh, hello, Kevin. Cool. And in tier <laughs> one... <laughs> and in tier one, we have... Wait, shit. Um, I think Kazmik's tier two now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Of course, right. we Dom's in tier two. Right. Uh, we have Kazmik slash Dom in tier two as well. Um, he was one in six going into last season, but now he's seven and seven. Wow. Neat. Wow. We have Cold Bacon, who just joined a few minutes ago. He made the season 17 intro. Uh, we have Hammerfan. He died to love in his debut season. And to the end. We have Michael, who died to PvE in his debut season. And his also that was also his first ever PvE death in a recorded round. What a good tier 1 we have here. Uh, we have Speedo, <laughs> one of the winners of the se season 15 contest. And he won his first season. We have Tommy SX. His last two to the end kills 
um, were both on players who had um, the letter V starting for their name. So, you know, don't kill me. Uh, we have Tooth. In his, in his six seasons, he's always died in either episode six or seven. And we have Vernon. In his three seasons, his team has always finished last. Fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, uh, tier one. What a great... What, I like how, like, two of the tier one players are people who have just the worst stats into the yeah, end possible. Like, 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 um, also, also joining us for the season, two specs, uh, Vinyl and Tags. I'm not cool enough I... to pass a vote, that's why I'm here. You also just That's not cool enough. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and with that, yeah. let's commence killing. I have yeah. power now. Yeah. 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 Hey guys, Joe here. Welcome to uh, to the end season nineteen. Oh man, this is uh, it's gonna, this is going to be interesting. It's uh, been a while since I've had to do a solo commentary for anything really. Uh, I'm excited for this though. Um, my plan is to go sort of blitz, to be honest. My plan is to go kind of blitz with this season. I would like to try and try and get things done pretty quickly and hope that that works out for me in the long run. It's very risky because I could get me killed very easily, but we'll see how it goes in the, in the end. Uh, sound volume seems to be good. Anyway, I should explain what we're doing. So this uh, may seem like it's a brief war, but it is not. We're actually doing... Um, tiered pick teams of four so everyone in the round has been put into tiers uh four tiers based on their skill level until the end and at the start we have seven solos or seven uh seven seven people on the team at the end of each episode or actually near the end of each episode um the the next uh the next lowest tier will then get a chance to join a uh, join a team of their choice out of the uh the ones listed. So, for example, the, the, the next tier 3 person can pick between Liz, Frost, and all them people. And then uh, 20 minutes after that, the, uh, the tier 2 people, like myself, because I'm a tier 2, gets to pick the uh, gets to pick which team they want to be on after that. Oh, good start. So, yeah, uh, I'm tier 2, which means I'm going to be alone for at least for the first 35 minutes. And that is a little bit concerning, but I think I'll be alright. Let's just get some coal here, and I want to, first priority is to get some food, because I want to be able to run around a lot. And uh, always one thing, I, and always one thing that always messes me up when I try and run around early in UHC, or Minecraft in general, is the fact they do not have any cooked food. So if I can get some cooked food early... That will be great. Oh, there's cows here too? Dude, we're in a good spot. There's also a little bit of a cave here, but I don't think that's going to really help us much. Alright, so immediately got ourselves a chicken. Let's get this pork cooked up. Alright, so we got cows, we got reeds, we had a chicken. Uh, just one chicken though. I think we should maybe go back and check for more. I'm going to turn on my sounds just a little bit. Because they're a little too quiet for me right now. Okay, and our coal has been collected. Let's turn a majority of this into some torches. Because I use those. Uh, get the chicken on the bar. Food is getting there, slowly but surely. Let's go kill those cows next. Uh, hopefully no one comes along and takes that takes that food, because that's going to be vital. Um, yeah, we got a few cool players in this season. I'm excited for this. Got leather. Oh, that looks like a good cave. Oh, and I got a chicken. Great, two feathers. Awesome. Oh, and there's a forest over there. Okay, so... Ooh, I think we should go to the forest first to get apples and then head over to the uh, that cave in the plains to do some caving. Uh, in terms of my coordinates, I'm at about halfway through both directions, which is pretty good. I'm going to take the furnace for now because I have plenty of stuff, and let's head straight over to that forest. But we'll also kill a couple more pigs on the way just so we can get a few things. Because we do need more food, and not comfortable with the amount we have. We do have a good amount of uh, books though. So yeah, let's get some more pigs. And now that we're able to run freely without having to worry about cooked food, we should be good to go. So yeah, priority for me, first of all. Oh, this uh, this forest actually leads right into it to the cave. Excellent. Okay, so I guess we'll start shopping down trees right here. Uh, have a decent amount of food. So yeah, uh, Blitz is working pretty decent for us so far. I'm going to set up another oven real quick. I'm going to set up right in here. Hopefully no one will take it. 
And we're going to put the food in there. Oh, damn, that means fallen here. Whoops. Mistake. There's also some more cows there if we so need it. And more. Oh, and more leather. And did I just see a person? No, I didn't. I thought I saw a person. Um, and in terms of who I want to really be on a team with, I don't really know. I'm fine with mostly anyone, to be honest. Uh, I think I think all these people could be fun to team with. I mean, uh, to the end is my favorite round to play. Always probably will be. It's uh, it's a great game to play. Great, great roster of people. I do kind of want to get revenge on Floss, though. After what happened in the last game, uh, it, it would be nice to kill Floss because um, he basically ruined me last game. That's like being on my damn team, so... Yeah, killing Frost would be uh, would be kind of nice because I've never been able to kill him in a recorded round. So maybe one of these days I'll be able to do that. Hey, we'll see. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to play this. It's been a lot of fun. I hope my solo commentary will be good for you guys. I like to think with my uh, with me doing streaming and such more these days that my solo commentary is pretty decent and that might make it enjoyable for you guys. We'll see. No apples yet, which is a little unfortunate. Hopefully we can get at least one. I'd ideally like maybe three. Three would be a good amount, I think, for me to go um, out with. So if I can get three apples, three golden apples, maybe, that would be pretty neat. But it's not required. I'm pretty comfortable with what I've got. So let's quickly get that. Let's quickly check that furnace that we had. Cooking. Food should be good. Yep, excellent. 14 pork. Looking good. No apples dropped yet, but I'm going to keep chopping a few more down because we do have time. Yeah, we've got uh, six uh, six minutes. I mean, four. No, we're six minutes in, even. Sorry. Let's see if we can get at least one apple. That would be perfect. We will see, though. Uh, let's chop down this tree, and I think this will be the last tree we chop. I think we'll stop after this, and we'll go maybe get some more book materials. So yeah, let's grab these reeds. Got some dogs, which is fun. Let's get more of these. And then we're going to get the cows, so we get more uh, leather. And then the only real issue is is uh, feathers. But I think we'll be alright with that. I think I think uh, maybe someone else will probably, find, uh, will probably find the feathers for us, hopefully. Okay, got that done. Thought I saw some bing ball down here, but I think we're good. Okay. So with all this done, I now have six leather and that. Let's go grab those. Uh, actually, I don't think we need more reeds. I think we should just go caving. So how's about we go grab that furnace and let's get into a cave system. Uh, assuming my furnace is still around here. Actually, we need, also need to check the apples, of course. That's vital. There we go. Got that. All right. Uh, let's quickly make ourselves... Nope, that's not right. Make ourselves some crafting tables so I can just keep placing them down and using them. Uh, oh, all right, nice. We got one apple. Great. That's awesome. Uh, any more, any more, any more. It doesn't look like it. One is fine, though. That is good with me. Let's head down into the cave and see what we can do. Uh, I like my coordinates. I think they're pretty safe. I think I can be content with this. And let's see where this cave gets us. Already we get some iron, which is an amazing start. Looks like we hit a dead end here. We're just going to double check so we don't get ambushed. Nope. All right, excellent. So we've got ourselves a good start here with the iron. I'm not picking it up though. I guess that was a bit of lag there. Uh, what I'm going to do actually is not do that. I am going to place this down and start cooking this up real quick. Just so I can uh, maybe get a water bucket before heading down. And maybe an iron pickaxe too to help me speed up the mining process a bit. Because uh, it's always good to have a quick pickaxe in these games I feel. I feel like it's a very vital thing to have. Hopefully no one comes down here and takes my iron while I'm smelting it. It's not much, but it's still a considerable amount. Also, I should probably actually get more dirt because I have blocks so important. But food-wise, I think we're good. Uh, still got about two minutes left. We're, about, we're, we're only eight minutes into the game so far. Uh, Rari's taking a harder damage. Everyone else is at full. Great. All right, so we got ourselves some dirt there. So block should not be an issue. We've got half a stack of dirt. Iron is almost done. I'm going to now set up a, a bucket. Uh, normally armor would be a priority of mine, but this season I think I want to try and yeah, blitz it. And that requires me to get a bucket. Uh, let's see. Got any water sources? Yes, we do. Also check to see if there's any more apples along the side here. But I'm not going to worry too much about it. Yeah, okay, we did get the water. Excellent. 
All right, uh, feeling pretty good here, although this seems very inconspicuous. All right, let's get the rest. Excellent. Oh, I just dropped my pick. Yes, I did. Bad move by me. Uh, wood. Do, 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 do. Sticks. Make an iron pick. All right. Okay, uh, let's get down. Uh, I'm worried about a lot of people in this game because there are a lot of good people. Uh, everyone's pretty good in this uh, in this UHC. There's a zombie, which is good. Hopefully, he can bring us down to some lower leveled caves. Decently quick. Let's see. Oh, all right, awesome. Got the cave instantly. Let's make sure we're good. I hear an Enderman. That isn't too good. There's a creeper. And there is a ravine. Let's see if we can deal with the creeper first. He was a... He is a... Oh, don't explode now. That's not good. There you go. That's how you do it. Don't be sneak like that with me. Alright, Y38, which is decent. Decent. That's uh, not ideal. Would like to get a bit lower, preferably. See, I've got to survive my own for a while. Uh, I'm not used to that. I haven't played solo in a recorded round in a long time. Let's check this out. How what have we got? Okay. Uh, seem to be good. Okay. Just to make sure that we're good, let's block ourselves in here. Whoops. Do I mind the iron? Because I'm hearing skeletons all around me and I don't really want to take damage to them. Okay. Um, okay, got more iron in here. This is why I wanted the bucket, just so I don't have to waste time with it later. Uh, that that's the skeleton. We're gonna block him off. We don't really want to fight him. Yeah, we're gonna try. I'm gonna try and stay at full health if I can. I don't really want to take a lot of damage this game. I want to try and uh, be pretty smart about my stuff. I don't want to uh, make any stupid decisions. One of my biggest mistakes in UHC these uh, last, ever since I've started playing more actively has been full damage. That's been a huge issue of mine. I've been trying to solve it ever since. I've been trying to take a lot less full damage. So, And I nearly just took full damage as I said that. That would have been hilarious. Uh, luckily I did not though. I do have some coal on me which is great. Uh, 26. That's pretty good. I probably want to try and find these mobs that I'm hearing. So we probably want to do a staircase down. Yep. Let's quickly cook up the, the iron we have. Uh, got plenty of crafting tables. Let's make another furnace. Okay, and dirt. I want to just block this off. Okay. Let's see if we can find this cave system. I think it's somewhere down here. So anyway, might be wrong. We'll see. Anyway, actually, I think it's above me a little bit. Let's see. Let's see if we can find these skeletons that we're hearing. They're close. Where are these guys? Aha! Here we go. Found them. Um, pretty good cave. Y23. Okay. And getting our armor situated here. Let's make ourselves an iron chest piece. How much time have we got on the episode? Uh, six, so we're 14 minutes in and we're just getting ourselves armored up. I think we'll be able to get full armored before the end of the episode, which would be ideal. I don't, this, I don't really need this chicken anymore, do I? All that, all that. Oh, I do need that. I don't really think I'll need that. Okay, uh, iron and iron. That's iron pants for me. I don't have enough for full armor yet, but if I can just get the iron boots, I think I'll be pretty happy. So we'll just get these last two pieces, and then we'll just put the rest away. So uh, there's one, and there's the other. Alright, so we'll make iron boots, which means we'll be three-fourths iron as we go down into this bottom cave, which is perfect. We want to get armored up quickly. Alright, so the cave system is right here. Let's take a peek. Try and make sure we're good here. Uh, Alright, seem oh, skeleton. Let's see if we can just get his attention. Hey, you. Yep, 
Yeah, you. Yeah, you. You see me. Gotcha. Oh, this cave. This cave is interesting. Uh, it goes down a little bit here, but to nothing. A little unfortunate. Uh, people are starting to take a bit of damage, which is nice. Okay, there's more iron. Good. And we've hit, bam, we've hit back at the ravine, except I think we're at a safer angle to it now. Because we were at a very dangerous angle with, uh, angle at it before. Okay, at this point, I think we have enough iron that we can start using our iron pick. And I think we should also probably start cooking up our iron to get the iron helmet. Let's quickly heat up, so we've got our saturation up. Let's take a peek. Uh, lava would be in here, apparently, which is nice. Good, this is why I wanted, this one of the reasons I wanted the water bucket early. Oh, nearly just fell in. Let's block that off. Uh, I don't see anything of... Uh, Super interest. Yeah, we're going to cross over the ravine here just to light up the top first. Also, we've got a few caves on the side, which is nice. I don't really want to go up there. Okay. Okay, so pretty secure area here, I think. A zombie is a potential issue. We'll see, though. Okay, still got four minutes to the end of the episode, and we're looking pretty good. We're going to be able to get full armored up. Which is kind of, which was kind of my main priority was just to make sure I had full armor before the end of the first episode, and it looks like I'm going to be achieving that as soon as I get back to my furnace. Excellent. All right, so let's put this down and let's make ourselves an iron sword. That's not how you make an iron sword. An iron helmet, and just in case, we're going to make a new iron pick too. All right. Fully armored up before the end of the first episode. Pretty sweet. I'm pretty good with that. Let's get down here next. Because we want to check out the ravine for potential diamonds, gold, and all that good stuff. Let's first block off the water sources here because they're just going to get annoying. And we're going to mine a bit of coal, I think. Just going to check down there. I don't think I see any diamond down there. It is a bit of a lava pool, but that doesn't tell me about anything. I do okay, let's keep let's keep it moving here. Oh, I lost my water. There it is. Oh, people are starting to be put onto teams, I didn't even realize. Oh, I'm out of torches. Crap. Didn't realize how uh, quick that was. Hole then. Hopefully, I can find some here soonish. Yep, there's some right there. Great. So, what teams? We've got uh, Longa. No, we've got, no, no, we've got uh, Chloe and Verbal. We've got Kanako and Solaz. We've got uh, Don and Katie and Frost and Benny. Alright, cool. Seems like a cool team. I'm a fan of these teams. Alright. Let's see. Uh, let's go this way next. Before we check out the main of the ravine. We may have to go back up to the surface soon just to find a new cave area. We'll soon see. Uh, no, no diamonds here. Dang. Kind of unfortunate, but can't really help it. Alright, let's get up and up and up. Beyond Frankie. The bill, the bill immediately goes to the never. That just seems like something Bill would do. Bill always goes to the never, like super early. What a guy. Uh, no diamonds there. Dang. Pretty bad luck starting off here. I hope we can uh, continue the. I hope we can uh, get get some better luck here in the future as the episodes go on. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got a cave here, maybe. 
Nope, nothing here. How about up here? Speed caving, speed caving. Gotta try and find, gotta try and find resources. Oh, okay, here we go. This looks pretty good. So many endermen, there's emeralds. I don't think those will be useful to me at all, but hey, we'll take them. We take those around here. There's an area above me there. Ugh, scary. And we've got the other side of the ravine. Okay, I think we're going to be heading up here. Or at least, or at least finding a place to dig down again, because we are not def we're definitely not in a safe spot here. So we're not getting anything from this. That is the end of the first episode, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.